So for those of you who don't know, we do advanced storage education and we bring in vendors and IT end users, same room, totally vendor independent of what our discussion is and it really brings up some lively discussion. The Q&A was mostly around IT as a service and software as a service. Uh, painful discussion. For whom? <laughs> it was great. It was a wonderful discussion. I, I enjoyed it. It was great to have that conversation because you know, they talked about the pressures they're under, and then we talked about what's actually happening in the industry, and a lot of the vendors, they kind of kept quiet here. They wanted to hear what, what these people are saying. I thought that was great. The other thing is occasionally we have people in that are, are resellers or distributors, and they're hearing both sides, and it's great for them, I think, because they get a perspective they rarely get to hear both of those at the same time. Right, because a lot of times the vendors think that they're educating by giving their sales pitch, but that's not really educating the end user or the buyer on what they really need to know, so it was good to hear another opinion. Yeah, and, and we, we get that feedback all the time. I really want to hear something that's not from somebody trying to sell me something. Yeah. Right. Yeah. And it's always, I think, what they like the most is when we do the, the last day when we go through all the products and we just kind of walk through, here's what this does, here's what this does, here's what this does, and um, you know, whether it's VMAX, 3PAR, XIV, you know, you name it. Yeah, I think they're really listening to what we say and they're trying to gather whether or not we really like a particular product or not. We do try to be very neutral about it. That's tough sometimes, you know. So but what did you guys think was the most controversial discussion in the last three days? The most controversial things, there's probably a couple areas. One is uh, really understanding what they were hearing from the vendors, and what we were saying about solid state. And I think when Russ went through a lot of the product details, that was very illuminating. The other one was probably around our discussions of the impact on server virtualization on storage. That was a, an area of real interest and some people really didn't understand that. You know, that, that really surprised me. I was, because storage virtualization has been out there so long and server virtualization has been out there so long, so not quite understanding all of that, it's, I get, and these are big companies. Yeah, exactly. But with I, big, massive implementations. But you know what that tells me? And maybe John could comment on it, but the knowledge base about storage it seems to be very localized in the, what's going on in the other side of the world about the applications and, and right. servers isn't really getting to these guys. As a team, we work together to understand the industry, predict trends, provide research that's unparalleled in depth. We offer research subscriptions on our website and keep our database current with announcements, releases, and updates. Look to the top of the page of our website and enter your email address to subscribe to our newsletter. You will receive free downloads of our research, news and articles from the analysts which highlight the latest information you need to know to stay informed about changes in the industry. Thanks for watching and be sure to navigate to our analyst video bios to get a flavor of each of our team members here at Evaluator Group.